Hello grade 6 and welcome to this week's weekly breakdown. So last week we finished the lesson of Earth's interior and we talked about the layers the, that make up the Earth and we talked about the two evidence that the scientists use to know more about the Earth layers without actually going in depth to the Earth layer. And now we are going to be starting with a different lesson, which is 7.2, Minerals. We are going to understand what mineral is. Usually, whenever we hear the word mineral, we think of gold, diamonds, beautiful crystals. So, for defining minerals, we know they are solid matter that form deep beneath Earth's surface. So, the minerals are found deep down the Earth's surface. So, what can these characteristics of minerals be? Characteristic is something that we use to describe the features of something. So, the minerals, they are solids. They can be formed by inorganic processes. And they have a crystal structure and a definite chemical composition. So, the five characteristics of minerals is naturally occurring, solid, form in organic processes, crystal structure, and definite chemical composition. These five characteristics make up a mineral. So, if we are trying to identify an unknown uh, mineral, we are supposed to check these five characteristics to assure that we have a mineral or we have found a mineral. Moving on to the properties that make up minerals. Streak, which is what color powder of a mineral. Luster is something where light is reflected, such as having metallic, glassy, waxy surface. Color, minerals come in many different colors. Density, we know that density is equal to mass over volume, so we're going to know that uh, different minerals have different densities. Hardness, how hard or how soft a mineral is, is ranked from 1 being the softest and 2 being the hardest. And a crystal structure, we have to know how many different phases and sides and uh, different number of phases and sides that a mineral has. And... As usual, we are going to assess ourselves by using online quizzes and interactivities and we are going to watch a lot of videos to understand more about the characteristics and properties of minerals. And that is it for this week, grade 6. Thank you so much.